In this video, I'm going to give you an overview of all of the templates that are available on the spreadsheetclass.com website. Now, by the time you watch this, maybe even more templates will have been added to the page, but this is going to be 24 of the most useful, or in some cases, the most fun templates for Google Sheets. If you want to get your own copies of these templates, they're completely free. And I've linked to the templates page in the description of the video. Now note that there's actually a lot more than 24 templates on the website, but there's actually simply 24 different kinds. And so what we're about to go over here is just an overview. And I definitely recommend that you explore the templates further to find all of the different versions. So first, let's get started with the business templates, and then we'll move on to some of the more fun templates. Now, the first templates are the sales templates. You simply fill in the different products that you have and the revenue that you earned on each different sale. And not only does this help you track individual transactions, but it will give you the total, and it will also give you the total for each different unique product. And then you'll have some charts to represent this data as well. And there's another version that will allow you to track by different category. More templates that you can find are schedule templates. And there's a variety of different templates that you can use as a calendar or a schedule to schedule appointments or to simply remind yourself of different tasks that you want to complete throughout the day and the week. Then we have to-do list templates, which is actually one of my favorites that I use in my personal life. I absolutely love checklists and these checklists, they let you fill in the different tasks that you want to complete. If you want, you can put the different dates for completion. You can sort the order and it will give you a list of incomplete tasks on the right side of the template. And it automatically crosses out the task after it's complete when you check the checkbox. If you want, you can check out the stock tracker templates. There's a lot of different versions from simple to advanced. You can track your portfolio, your performance, you can track your watch list, and a lot more. This report builder template is actually really, really cool. What it allows you to do is automatically generate a report with your data without actually having to input formulas on your own. You just select different options from the dropdown, and you can sort the data by the exact columns that you want, filter it in the exact way that you want, calculate averages and sums, and then generate a final clean report at the end without these headers at the top, but with all of the totals, the averages, and with the data filtered and sorted in the exact way that you want. And the instructions for this template and all of the other templates are available on each individual page. Then we have the budget and expense tracker templates. And in this case, there are nine different versions so you'll be able to find the exact version that you want, whether you want to track a month of expenses or a year of expenses. You can choose versions where you can set a monthly budget or you can choose to budget by each individual expense. There's a lot of different versions that you can check out. The project management timeline templates are a really good way to track the timelines of different tasks or different projects that you have at your business. It's a way to not only track them, but to visualize them. And so you can enter different tasks, specify the start date and the end date, and color on the screen will automatically pop up representing the timeline for each different task. And then you can set the priority, which will change the color of that task. There's a lot of different calendar templates that you can choose from, from simple manual versions to automatic versions. There's calendars where all 12 months are shown on one tab. There's calendars where each month is represented by one tab. You can find the exact version that you need for whatever you want to do. There's an inventory template where you can track all of the different things that you need for the inventory for your business. You can track how much you have of each product the location of the product, and you can also set up a tracking system to notify you when you're out of stock, or you can also specify when inventory has already been ordered. There's a template that you can use to keep track of your contacts, and you can also search through your contacts really easy in a variety of ways, whether you're searching for a specific name or whether you want to filter your contacts by a certain letter. If you ever find yourself searching for a job, 
the job application tracker template will allow you to keep track of all of your different applications for all of the different companies that you are in the application process with. If you have loans and you want to calculate how long it would take you to pay off your loan if you paid a certain amount, there's a loan payoff calculator template. Now we're going to go over the templates for teachers and then we'll get into the templates that are fun for everyone. If you want to track your students' grades, there's multiple grade books you can track by points or by percentage. You can track attendance in a variety of ways and the sheet will automatically let you set which days are considered weekends, which will not only highlight the sheet to visually separate the weekends, but it will automatically adjust the calculations to account for the weekends as well. There's a math problem solver, which is one of my favorites. You can solve a wide variety of different math problems such as algebra and geometry. It makes it very simple to either check your work or grade tests if you're a teacher. Now here's an even cooler math template. If you have students or you have kids that you want to test for math, this math worksheets template is a really great way to learn and test for a variety of math subjects. And the really cool thing about this template is that there are a lot of different settings that you can customize to generate different tests in the exact way that you want. You can set the difficulty level, whether or not you want decimals or for the problems to be all whole numbers. You can select the different subjects that you want to be in the test. It will give you an answer key that teachers can use and it will automatically grade each different question as well as the entire test. There's a variety of different graph paper templates that you can choose from. There's different sizes of squares to choose from, and there's different shades of squares to choose from so that you can find the exact type of graph paper that you want. All right, so let's get into the fun templates. This is one of the templates that people seem to enjoy the most, and that's, of course, if you play guitar. And so this is the guitar tabs template. This template will allow you to easily create your own guitar tabs, which if you don't play guitar and you're not sure what that is, it's basically like a simple version of writing music. And all you have to do is enter numbers into the cells and it makes a much easier way to write your own guitar tablature. If you're like me and you like a ton of different movies and shows and you have a hard time keeping track of all of it, or maybe you simply have a movie collection and you wanna keep track of that, there's a movie list template, or if you want, there's simply a general list template where you can track your collection of anything. And you can create your own list of genres that will automatically populate the dropdowns. So you can select the genre for each different show or movie. The template will have different tabs for movies, shows, books, or whatever else that you want. All right, so if you're looking for a home, and you're trying to compare different homes, this house hunting template is a really great place to do it. You can keep track of all of the different things that you need to when you're considering which home to buy, and it makes it easy to compare or even sort the list. And there's a place to put the link for the listing. And if you hover over the link for the listing, the picture of the house on the page for that listing will automatically pop up in your Google spreadsheet without even having to visit that page. And so it's a really easy way to keep track of the houses that you're considering to buy or the apartments that you're considering to rent. So here's another really cool one where you can keep track of your weightlifting routine. This will allow you to track your individual workouts and it will also allow you to track your different maxes like your one rep max, five rep max, and so on. There's a different tab for each different lift where each different row lets you track a new workout and then there's also a personal records tab where you can keep track of your personal records for each different lift that you have specified. Now, very similar here, we have a weight loss calculator. And as you can see, this allows you to track your weight loss progress in a very detailed way. Not only does it let you track your weight loss, but it also allows you to set goals for yourself. And you can view how much you've lost in total as well as how much you've lost each month. And there's a lot more to this template as well. It's pretty cool. A lot of people don't know that you can use Google Spreadsheets to translate languages. And so that's exactly what this template does is it allows you to enter text in one language to translate it into another language. You can simply specify the languages that you want at the top 
and then put the text that you want to translate in column A, and it will translate it in column B. Well, this template is pretty self-explanatory. It's tic-tac-toe. It's fun to play at work. That's about it, tic-tac-toe. So all of these templates are available to use for free. So I hope you liked this video. If you did, please like and subscribe and have a great day.